So you do have a drop doing transmit, but the meter gets stuck. And that's how some of these meters are. It's probably got some crap down in the meter movement. Okay, got the SB200 here. Output. About 600 watts. That's on the high setting. Input over here is about 60 watts. Frequency is 7.250 megahertz. And I'm running an AM carrier. You key this down, you can adjust the tune and the load to peak it. And then this is the grid current. This is the plate current, a little bit high. What I wanted to show this though here is the high voltage on here. This has got a sticky meter. That's really the purpose of this video. Key this down, it gets stuck. So if you go down here and turn this to SWR, you've got no input. So you do have a drop doing transmit, but the meter gets stuck. And that's how some of these meters are. It's probably got some crap down in the meter movement. You can go adjust this out, but this has got a dead band here of about, uh, from where you zero there to about the 50 mils on the plank current. So there's the high voltage because it swung really quick it's going to get hung up this way if I transmit down or turn this off it tends to go to a different spot now I'm going to go ahead and try change the drive down to be about 40 watts there's a 40 watt drive and that's about 500 watts if you can believe the meter I'll put this on relative power turn that so you can get some deflection I'll go through and tune this tend to peak that and I'll Try to peak this. There's the grid. If I go down here and change the power to be, let's say only, let's turn it to be 30 watts. It's about 30 watts in. Now you're going to have, if you can believe that, around 400 out. Gains a little bit over 10. Put this on relative power. This just knob just adjusts the gain on the meter. So you can go through here and tweak this. It should be about in the same spot. grid currents less. If I go down here and change this to be let's say only about uh, it's on the 100 scale let's turn this to be just about that should be 10 watts that's 10 watts 10 watts in you get about Roughly about a hundred out. Now we can put this on a low scale. Roughly about a hundred. And we'll look at the grid current. Hardly ever changes the grid current at all. Because the tubes are just loafing along. So the gain is about 10. A little 10 to 11. Whatever you send in. This is an SB200. This is a typical problem where the meter's got some 
uh, stickiness to it. That can be either there's some crap down in the bearing, some dirt, a uh, piece of fuzz drawn in from the fan, and so it's got drag. Um, I probably should go look at that with a magnifying glass. These used to be $10 in the original price list from 1964. But that's an SB200. It's got two 572Bs in it. And I'm just playing around here. 